Well, the Lynchburg City School Board met last night to go over the superintendent's budget request for the fiscal year 2017. The board says it's still reviewing the proposal, but right now it stands at well over a million dollars more than last year. And as WSLS 10's Rob Nanch found out, one city councilor not happy about it. We're hearing more excuses. There. City Councilor Jeff Helgeson says schools in Lynchburg are on the decline, and he can't understand why prices are going up. It's mind-boggling that they would be asking for more money in spite of the fact that we just had a, a joint meeting mm -hmm. where they showed how poorly they were. Right. I mean, they were paltry, the results. But schools are asking for more quite a bit more. This year, the schools are projecting a $1.068 million funding gap. Schools say that will fund new staff, raises for employees, and transportation support for students, among other things. But Helgeson says he doesn't buy it. And that's irrelevant. They have excuses all the time. Sure. I mean, sure. So, so just to say, they've had a, a system, a culture of excuses ever since I've been on council since 2004. Every year there's another excuse. Helgeson says the city has not only been meeting state standards for school funding, it's been exceeding them every year. In 2015, council was required by the state to fund slightly more than $18 million of the school system budget. The city ponied up more than $39 million, but Helgeson says he's not impressed with the results. You almost have to, to work hard to perform that poorly. Um, so you could have had the same result with half of the money, it went to put our citizens in, in where we're number six as size as fiscal stress now in the whole Commonwealth of Virginia. The last three years, the city has met the school's funding requests. Now, as the school board moves closer to approval, he hopes the council will put up a fight. I do hope that council will consider our taxpayers this year. In Lynchburg, Rob Manch, WSLS 10.